All right, hey everybody, it's um, 23 weeks. We're driving, Kyle's driving, I'm in the passenger seat. So I didn't do my vlog this weekend because we were busy, we had family in town, and so I'm doing it two days late. So 23 weeks in two days, you guys, which is cool. This is not completely new, it's something I keep forgetting to mention, but I started having um, a little bit of like leakage from this area. <laughs> and it's um, and what it would be is I wouldn't really ever feel anything, but then there would be tiny dry um, It looks like little crystals, you know like left in my bra And I know what that is. I mean, you know, I had a kid before and I've nursed and everything so familiar with that But then this week randomly one day I was sitting happily Minding my own business at my computer and all of a sudden I feel a lot of wet I look down and it's like I've leaked this big circle of, of, of uh, milk or whatever colostrum that was like whoa so yeah so that area is definitely getting ready <laughs> which is great because I will be nursing again and then let's see what other symptoms I said this last week that the baby kicks and it's crazy but I'm gonna say it again because it's gotten even more so he moves so much and now it's gotten to where even his subtle movements not just his kicks but even his like subtle flinches and and um, shakes I see through my stomach and I can the other day I was standing in the kitchen and I felt him moving and I looked down and through my shirt I could just see my stomach moving and I was like really so it's crazy but it's really cool like I'm a fan of it it's just it's just kind of surprising me that it's this early and it's I just see him so much and he's just clearly very much on the outside of my stomach you know what I mean like He's, he is, is close to the outside. <laughs> He's not back inside of me. And I think Sophie, you know, um, as I mentioned in earlier vlogs, my placenta with her was in the front um, of my uterus, so by my belly. So she was, there was block. Like, you know, her, her movements were blocked. And this kid, it's just like all there for me to see. Oh yeah. Um, I'm still feeling really great and comfortable. And I swear I'm more comfortable than I was with Sophia. But I have started to get, you know, um, when I wake up in the mornings, my shoulders hurt a little. And I think it's from at night, the way I'm laying um, to compensate for my growing belly. Um, it's just like putting, you know, extra pressure or whatever. So Kyle pulled out my um, pregnancy pillow that I love. And I'll put a link to it um, to where you can find it down below. But anyway, so I'm going to start sleeping with that again to help because those pillows really are really great. If you think, oh, I don't need one, whatever, I'm telling you, um, I waited to get one with Sophia. And then when I finally bought one, I was like, why did I wait? Because it, it made such a big difference. And it was better than just sticking a pillow between my legs to help align my hips. Like, this one really helped me a lot. So um, I do recommend those. Those are one of those things that I bought and was not sad about, but was worried I would buy and not think was that great. <laughs> Otherwise, not really. Been doing good? Yeah, I mean, ah, guys, I don't even know how to... Um, this weekend, I'm, I'm getting on a stricter, healthier diet uh, because I've been slacking, haven't been eating that. It's like, I'll eat some healthy things, but then I mix in a lot of non-healthy things, so I didn't want to do that. So for the next month, I'm going to try to be um, a lot better, and hopefully it'll become a habit. So that's kind of a, the plan. And then, other than that, I'm growing a lot. Like, don't you think, too? Like, my belly's, like, really growing, like, quickly now. <clears throat> Which it should be. The baby's growing a lot. We still can't think of a name. For those of you who read my blog, you read my little, like, entry about picking a name and how it's stressing me out. So, if you haven't read that, you should go read it because I don't even want to get into it. But, yeah, that's been bothering me. <laughs> and so, other than that, I have tons of stuff for the next Operation Get Ready for Baby video. So, yeah, I'll do that. And um, sorry for the quick update. And a belated update, but at least I got one up. Woo! So I will show you guys the live action belly shot.
my belly button is popping out. Not all the way, but a little bit. <laughs> And then I will let you see the pictures and you can see my incredible growing belly and all its glory. And other than that, I will just talk to you guys next week. I have my doctor's appointment tomorrow on Monday, so yay. It's just my normal 24 week um, appointment. So it should just be standard. I think at this appointment I'm gonna get all my, um, my like I think they're gonna give me the little glucose drink and all that stuff to take for the next appointment. So, and I've already had people and they were asking if I would do it live on camera, drink the drink like I did with Sophie and um, Shore. <laughs> that was hilarious the last time. I'll put a link to that video if you wanna go see what I'm talking about. Other than that, I will talk to everybody next week at week 24. Bye guys. Sing it the blues. <laughs>